what is the syllabus of gate life sciences because we know gate life sciences are divided into three different sections there is a general aptitude section which is compulsory there is also chemistry section which is compulsory but apart from general aptitude and the chemistry section there is also uh, this other syllabus of the subject that you choose and you can choose any two subject of your choice so what is the syllabus for the subject of your choice in a nutshell i'm going to share the syllabus of get life sciences uh, based on the subject that you choose so i'll click the syllabus and here you have fundamental knowledge will be tested for section a general aptitude the syllabus is common all for all gate papers it's common verbal ability will be provided where english grammar sentence completion verbal analogies word groupings instructions critical reasoning and verbal deductions will be um, provided okay next uh, it is the numerical ability where numerical computation numerical estimation numerical reasoning and data interpretation will be provided so that is uh, the group a compulsory you cannot skip it then there is another compulsory section that is chemistry compulsory chemistry and here we have structure and bonding we have s and p and d block elements we have chemical equilibria we have electrochemistry we have reaction kinetics thermodynamics organic reaction mechanisms and chemistry of biomolecules all these things will be under the compulsory chemistry syllabus you cannot skip it you need to attend this and uh, section a and section p these two sections together will consist of 40 percent of the total marks of of the gate life science syllabus next we move to the uh, optional section any two section you can choose from the optional section any two subject either it is biochemistry botany microbiology zoology or a food technology from these five different sections you can choose any two if you are from modern biology subjects then choose biochemistry and microbiology if you are from classical biology subjects then choose zoology or botany zoology microbiology botany microbiology zoology biochemistry it is your choice if you are from food and nutrition you need to choose food technology and then you choose zoology probably or biochemistry which will suit your preparation style now if you get inside of this all sections well biochemistry is called as section q botany as section r microbiology as section s zoology as section t food technology as section u now if you get inside the biochemistry section here you have organization of life enzyme kinetics regulation and inhibition vitamins and coenzymes metabolism molecular biology and immunology all these topics need to be studied for biochemistry section for botany section you need to study plant systematics and anatomy plant physiology genetics plant breeding gene modification ecology and environmental biology plant pathology is very very important for last few years in microbiology section you need to study historical uh, perspectives and methods microbial taxonomy and diversity prokaryotic and eukaryotic cells microbial growth and control microbial metabolism microbial genetics virology and immunology for section t zoology uh, you need to study animal diversity classification of animals evolution genetics biochemistry and molecular biology cell biology animal anatomy and physiology parasitology and immunology developmental biology ecology and animal behavior now if you compare the syllabus you'll realize if you select zoology the element or the number of subject that you need to study is huge so it's better to choose biochemistry and microbiology if you ask me i'd choose biochemistry and microbiology because whatever is there in biochemistry and microbiology zoology covers them all plus some additional syllabus next last is the food technology in food technology you can go with food chemistry and nutrition food microbiology food products technology and food engineering process if you are from biotechnology or food and nutrition definitely select food technology and along with that you can select microbiology or biochemistry as a better combination for your selection of subjects so these are the selection of subjects that you need to do for the syllabus or the preparation of 
these uh, gate life sciences and obviously refer to the official website and the official website link and details uh, will be provided here uh, get into the official website and uh, you can see all the details that we mentioned in here in the official website and that's going to help you uh, get all the information because always verify the information because uh, once you see the video the video may be uploaded a uh, time back so always validate and verify the information from the official website don't believe anyone but yeah believe the trusted sources that are out there so this mind map is going to help you understand every little details of get life science syllabus if you need to know about this watch the full video on every little details of the CS and uh, or every little details of the get life science syllabus and get excel preparation and if you want to prepare for get excel the syllabus similarity of get excel of all the subjects is same very similar more than 98 percent similarity with the CS and net syllabus so we at Shomus Biology provides study material for that you can get the study material package 64 GB pen drive plus 5 books for 8,900 rupees and only 64 GB pen drive for 7,900 rupees from us directly and that's going to help you immensely for the preparation of Get Life Sciences so if you want to order then contact this given number 9804654228 or visit our website www.shomusbiology.com now to get this particular uh, uh, mind map uh, that I shared you need to download our app and inside the app I'll try to upload this mind map so download Shomus Biology application from Google Play Store see you in the next video uh, in the next video I'll be talking about how to prepare uh, for the Get Life Sciences with detailed six month study plan with daily routine. See you there. Bye.